Announcement, Prayer for All Nations The Bible says in Matthew 24 verse 6 to 14, You will hear of wars and rumors of wars, beware of being troubled, for these things must happen. But it won't be the end yet. A nation will rise up against a nation, and a kingdom against a kingdom, and there will be famines and earthquakes in various places. All this will only be the beginning of the pains. Then they will give you up to torment, and put you to death, and you will be hated by all nations because of my name. Then also many will succumb, and they will betray and hate one another. Many false prophets will arise, and they will deceive many. And because iniquity has increased, the charity of the many will grow cold. But whoever endures to the end will be saved. This good news of the kingdom will be preached in all the world, to serve as a witness to all nations. Then will come the end. Beloved, the evolution of the geopolitical and geostrategic situation of the world today challenges us to the pure truth of the Word of God. If we do not want to see World War III break out and the nuclear bombs fall on our homes and carry us away, let us take upon ourselves individually this task of praying for the nations from the 1st of September 2024 of the Gregorian year until the 1st of January 2025 of the Gregorian year. Everyone is free to pray as he can, fasting or without fasting, that is, according to how the Spirit of God will lead each one in his or her fasting abilities and faculties. Example, if you could for example fast two times, one time, time, three or five times a week, do it. This is an example I give. As Proverbs 21 tells us, verses 1 to 2, I read the word of God in the almighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. The king's heart is a stream of water in the hand of the Lord, he tilts it wherever he wants. All the ways of man are right in his eyes, but the one who weighs hearts is the Lord. May God direct the hearts of the leaders of this world and let them do what God wants. May God shut the mouths of the blood-drinking demons. Daniel 6 the 22nd verse I read the word of God in the almighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. My God sent his angel and shut the mouths of the lions, who did me no harm, because I was found innocent before him, and before thee also, O king, have I done nothing evil. Psalm 123, verse 4. I read the word of God in the almighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Our soul is sufficiently satisfied with the mockery of the proud, the contempt of the haughty. May God stop this fight. Psalm 46, verse 9 to 10. I read the word of God in the almighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. It is he who has stopped the fighting to the ends of the earth, he broke the bow, and broke the spear, and consumed the chariots of war with fire. Stop, and know that I am God, I have dominion over the nations, I have dominion over the earth. Ecclesiastes 10 verse 7 I read the word of God in the almighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I have seen slaves on horses, and princes walking on earth like slaves. Let the slaves get off the horses and make way for the princes. Proverbs 19, verse 10 I read the word of God in the almighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. It is not fitting for a fool to live in delight, how much less for a slave to rule over princes. Daniel chapter 2, verses 21 to 22. I read the word of God in the almighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. 
It is he who changes times and circumstances, who overthrows and establishes kings, who gives wisdom to the wise and knowledge to those who have understanding. He reveals what is deep and hidden, he knows what is in darkness, and the light dwells with him. Job 12, verse 18 I read the word of God in the almighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. He unties the girdles of kings, he puts a rope around their loins. So be it for all methods of destabilization. Doctrines and Dogmas Colonization and Neocolonialism The Public Limited Companies Secrete Sex Tourism Games Witchcraft and the Occult Prostitution and the Prostitution Industry Nymphomania or Hypersexuality Animal Rights Conspiracy Theorists Astrology and Magic The Lobbies, the Bribes, the Corruption Zoophilia, Lying Down with a Dog Sophisticated Political Cosmopolitans The Media Fake News and Fake News Disinformation State Terrorism Sexual Slavery Forced Labor or Exploitation of Man by Man The Shock Strategy to Scare the People and to Accept what their Leaders Offer Them The Catholic Church and all the other churches that keep leading thousands of people to hell every day NGOs and other organizations of this world the right of men, the rights of women, the rights of the child. Echoes, CMAC, the Arab League. The glories of this world. The loans and debts of nations by the leaders of the countries on their backs. Through the banks. Slavery of banks, theft and fraud. The pride of the Westerners. The privatization of state assets by the gurus of the people. The hypocrisy of nations. Racism, tribalism, ethnicizes. The francophony and anglophobia. The World Bank. The IMF or International Monetary Fund. The American Project of a World Constitution. Pedophilia Homosexuality Lesbianism Abortions Family planning Transsexuality Alcohol and smoking The drugstore Crime State terrorism Mafia companies the constitutions of states and nations. Parliaments. NGOs or non-governmental organizations. WHO or World Health Organization, invention of diseases. Coins. Space colonization. Totalitarianism. Utopianism. Conspiracy Theories Easements The Collectivist System UNESCO G8, the G20, the G5 Loose Soft Power The United Nations and all its organs The International Criminal Court Supranationalism Free Trade Agreements The Puppeteers of the Shadows The Sellers of the Moon and Other Planets The Internet The Illuminati The Lodges, the Fran Masonry, the Rosicrucian etc. 
The Bilderberg Club. The TikTok and social networks. Pornography. Socialism. Imperialism. Capitalism. The left, the right, centrism. The outbreak of economic crises. Armaments. War industries and wars. Diplomacy and political science. Dictatorships. Terrorism. The attacks. The treaties. The charters. The global caliphate responsible for establishing a common law for all humanity. Democracy. Sects. Pacts and Alliances The World Nobles The World's Famous Families The Lobbies Global Firms Multinationals May the Lord Jesus bless you, the Father of Nations, the Apostle Jism. Shalom, Shalom Waira apeto penko Waira apeto yesu penko Waira apeto yesu penko Waira apeto yesu penko Waira